Good. Are you weak? I'm dead. Go away. Mr. Anderson, open the door, please. Piss off. I'm coming in, Michael. How are you feeling today? Happy. Are you sure? Uh, brought you breakfast. I've got your medication here too. Don't need to be drugged up. Please, I want to be alone. You're not eating, Michael. I'm not hungry. I've been admiring this record player for weeks. Don't touch it. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have. It was my husband's. Every day we danced to our song. He really was something special. Not afraid of anything. Couldn't say no to a dance. He was the life of any party. Then one day, he wasn't there to play our next song. My family weren't exactly happy for me when I told them I was gay. My wife, she couldn't forgive me, but there's no way I could have been honest with her back then. There's no telling what may have happened if I'd been open about myself. I just had to conform. It must have been so lonely. When I met Richard, I could finally be myself. Well, what do you think he'd say to you, if he could see you now? He'd probably wring my neck for being so miserable. I can't imagine going on without him. He made everything feel right. But you're not alone, Michael. All the staff are here to support you. I appreciate that, son. It's just not the same. I know. I'll drop by later. Why don't you put it on? It wouldn't feel right without him. You played your song every day. Maybe it's time for the next song. 